<laughs> it is nine right now and I am heading to my painting studio. Classes have been moved online, but I honestly don't get the point because I still have to go work on my painting midterms in studio. for tonight. Do you want to say hi, Barry? <laughs> hi, Barry. <laughs> oh yeah, I will definitely show. <laughs> I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> I wonder if there'll ever be a vlog where I'm not doing a face mask. Today is Monday, technically the first day of spring break. I don't know if studios are gonna be closed down because of the virus, because I still need to work on my painting midterms. If studios get closed down, I don't know what I should do. Most of my friends have already gone back home. I'm gonna be staying here, kind of worried. I'm trying to go out less and when I do go out less, I sanitize a lot and I wear a mask and on subways I wear gloves because I just- ah! There is no bread or rice in the grocery store, it's wild. But on the bright side this morning, I got up, cleaned my room, it's so neat right now, I'm amazed. I usually go to yoga classes but obviously they've been closed down so but yeah, I really don't know what's going on with my studios. I lost one pillowcase. Oh, I found a pillowcase.
I am moving all my stuff out from the studio right now back to the apartment. I will get back to this whenever this ends. So sad. Today I am very, very bored. I've literally been awake for like seven hours and I've reached peak boredom. Therefore, I have decided to film another transformation video. Okay, there's so much hair in my eyes. Like a, you look like a bootleg gamer girl. <laughs> Wait, that's what I'm trying to be. Oh my gosh, that be my channel, bootleg. Why? 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 How the fuck did you put wake up? Ow! This hurts. It's balding. Wait, I just realized I never, I never filmed the end to my makeup video. Hold on, let me finish this. Oh, what the fuck? Don't you think your wig back on? I already took it off. Anyways, uh, thank you. No, I'm gonna be in the video. Okay. <laughs> Giga. Oh, yes. <laughs> <You -hoo. My attention span is so short these days. I've literally I've literally worked on this for like 30 minutes and I don't feel like doing it anymore. <laughs> I'm kind of hungry because I had a small breakfast at 8 I think. I'm gonna cook an early lunch. It's like almost 11. I'm really bored. <laughs> This is my lunch today before I go to studio. Literally all I've been doing is cooking. But yeah, there's noodles underneath. I'm so awkward. <laughs> I'm scared. Why? Our late night snack. Hi. <laughs> 
So <laughs> how early are you making this anniversary gift? One month. <laughs> Basically, yeah. <laughs> This is my brunch. I'm going to bed right after this. I completely fucked up my sleeping schedule. <laughs> I've been napping all day and I feel like I'm gonna fall asleep again. I would do a really nice aesthetic shot of me working on art, but let me just tell you, I'm a mess. My hair is a mess. I am literally in my underwear because that's all I wear at home and a shirt. And all I've been doing is eating and sleeping. I might work out later. I will see. I don't know. This whole thing stresses me out. So I'm just gonna quickly interrupt this vlog and say that this video is sponsored by Audible. I want to thank Audible for sponsoring this video. If you guys didn't know what Audible is, it is an online site where you can listen to audiobooks. And one audiobook that I have listened to is Frankenstein. I had to read it for English class and I think it's important to mention that I have a very short attention span when it comes to reading. So when I had an essay to write on Frankenstein, that was not good because 
I barely read it in class. So I listened to the audiobook of Frankenstein to write my essay and that helped a lot. <laughs> I didn't do that good, but it's okay. Like I pass, it's fine. When I was younger, I used to love reading books. I don't know what happened. I can't even read for fun now just because my attention span is so short. I can barely focus. So that's why Audible has helped a lot. So not only does Audible have a ton of audiobooks for you to choose from, they also have an unnamed selection of original audio shows, news, and comedy. So every month, if you're a member of Audible, you get one credit to choose any title. And you also get two Audible originals from a monthly selection and you also get access to news and online meditation programs so whatever it is that you're trying to do for example trying to cram in an english essay the night before it's due even though you never read the book or trying to become a better person trying to become a better chef anything it's on audible and you can listen to it anywhere anytime it's available on mobile alexa bluetooth and more so if you guys are interested in audible make sure to check out the link www.audible.com slash cup of jasmine or you can also text cup of jasmine to 500 500 in order to get a 30-day free trial and you can also get one free audiobook and two Audible originals for free. So again, thank you to Audible for sponsoring this video and back to the vlog. It's been a week since I cleaned my room and it's really messy. So um, I need to clean. I had fried rice for lunch as usual. And then after I'm probably gonna watch some shows. I'm really bored. So these are a few designs that I've done the past few days. I'm still working on this one. This one is taking a long time. But yeah, if you guys are interested, I am taking bookings for possibly April. If you guys book for April, we might have to reschedule, but definitely May, I think. And a few updates because I realized that when I was vlogging, I didn't really tell you guys what was going on. Wait, I lost track of time. What day is it today? Tuesday. Last week was my spring break, so I didn't have class. This week, I also don't have class because my professors are taking a week to figure out how to freaking do art school online. My English professor was like, I'm not even gonna bother with like Zoom or anything, just email me stuff and then my archive studio professor and my painting professor are both like we don't know what to do and my printmaking professor hasn't even emailed me about anything i'm pretty sure he's just confused because he's like how are students supposed to like carve you know and also i don't have anything to carve with because everything from printmaking was in the studio and i didn't have time to even go get it before the school completely shut down Sad. Last week, I was pretty sad because for the past two months, ever since second semester started, I was on a really good time management schedule and a really good fitness and like eating schedule. But like since everything happened last week, I got really stressed. I stress eat, which means that my fitness declines and I stopped working out for a bit and I got kind of more stressed because of that, but to get myself back on track, I am doing a two week workout challenge, which you guys will see in two weeks. I woke up today and I was like, I can't live like this anymore. I can't just sit in bed and be sad every day, but I'm feeling a lot better now. This whole social distancing thing hopefully helps because you know what? I'm sure everyone has heard it. So I'm not even gonna say it. For those that are wondering, I am practicing social distancing, but I'm also gonna go out to get groceries and I also just need fresh air. I feel like I'm gonna go crazy in here. 
I also forgot to mention that I tattooed myself because I had nothing better to do and I was aching to tattoo something so I did a chrysanthemum on my leg it took quite a long ass time I was in pain not because my leg was in pain but because the position that I was sitting in to tattoo myself was so painful but yeah beauty is pain <laughs> it turned out really well so I'm super happy about that but anyways I hope that you guys enjoyed this vlog and I'll see you guys soon bye bye